Hello everyone, how's it going? In this video, we're going to see what is happening with the Neo stock, its penetration into the Europe market through Norway, and what are the plans for the US market? So let's get right into it. Neo announced that its flagship vehicle, the ES8, is going to be launched in Norway later this year in the September month. But prior to the launch of the vehicle, Neo has to come down to Norway and establish its ecosystem. And by ecosystem, we mean the battery as a service, the customer service, the whole ecosystem that Neo needs for its customer, so even before the car comes on the road. So those are some things that Neo has already started working with. Now, there is a few things. Neo is focusing on one city right now, which is the city of Oslo. And later next year in 2022, it is gonna bring in another vehicle along with opening four other spaces in other four cities of Norway. So this is a huge deal for them and they're targeting. Now, why Norway is of interest here? So let's go get into this one. So it looks like the Norwegian EV market. So the year of 2020, Norwegian EV market sold about 54% of the vehicles were EV. So of all the vehicles that were sold in Norway, 54% were EV vehicles. And the more astonishing factor is in December alone, the market share grew up to 66%. And no other country in the world is even close to reaching the same results as Norway. So it looks like so, and somehow Norway is becoming the capital for EV market penetration. So that's where e Neo has concentrated and started to get into. That's a bold move and that's a very interesting move. So something to look into. Now, what is Neo doing for the US market? Before I go into this, let me come down here and let me show you what the Neo director has informed about US. So he said when they, he was questioned about the US market, he said US car verification standards are different from those of Europe or China. Neo has already cleared the verification standards that are required for Europe, but for US, it says that we need to redevelop our car models to enter the US which we have no energy to do now as a startup, but we will do it later. So they have something in mind, but this is something interesting to look into. So California, the DMV of California has authorized Pony AI to test driverless vehicles in Fremont and three, two other cities of California. Pony AI is a company that's been backed by Neo Capital. So they have already started testing vehicles on the Californian streets for the US market. So that's something which they've already kept their mind on, they're already focusing towards. So that's really interesting to look into. So with that, take care, stay safe, bye-bye.